I need Julie to put a jacket on because we're all in white. I asked her. <laughs> I asked her before we came on. Julie, you need to put a jacket on. Blood out. I, I haven't had time. Does someone? Come is there on. I told you. I told you two hours ago. We know Amber, in chat room. This is not. So I'm sorry. I've been flat out. Let's have a look and see what the fuss is about. I need Julie to put a jacket on because we're all in white. I asked, her to, <laughs> I asked her before we came on. Julie, you need to put a jacket on. What the fuck? We're all in white. What does, she, what does she mean? Like, is that how struggling they are for diversity? Like, we can't all be in white. No. No, don't do it. No, we need something black on here. It's fucking crazy, isn't it? Blood out. I haven't I, had time. Does someone? Come is there on! A... I told you. I told you two hours ago. We know Amber, in chat room. This is not. So I'm sorry. I've been flat out. Well, honestly. I'll call wardrobe and we'll get something. No, if if, I... if if you give me a sec. We'll call wardrobe. We'll call wardrobe. <laughs> Don't worry. I got a speed doll. Second, if we can ask, I, I'm not sure who your lineup is today. If if there's a, just a jacket oh, floating around out there, ask Danica. Unless you want to run down and see if there's a jacket. No, you're right. No, you're open. right because you told me um, it's fine, Sandy. But there can't be three of us. No. And I, I made this clear two and a half hours ago. Amber, if it's an issue, I can, I can get on yeah, out of here. It is an issue. Go and grab a jacket. <laughs> oh snap. If it's an issue, I'll get out of here. I've got things to do. I've, I've got places to be, mate. Places where they let me wear white. <laughs> I, uh, Jenny, someone, uh, someone able to grab me a jacket, please. If it's an issue, I, I wasn't, can. I wasn't saying it for no reason. The wardrobe girls would be furious. <laughs> the wardrobe girls would be furious. They're down there ripping their hair out. Oh no! What have we done? All three of them wearing white. Downstairs. I'm wearing also... blue for one, Amber. I, I don't know, want to be having this. It doesn't look like it. it. Someone, Jenny, get someone in. Some, a producer. I told her this two and a half. There's one hanging up outside the control room. Just get it on. There's a black one hanging up. There's a black one hanging up on the back if of there's, my if one. There's, she seems to know fucking where every bloody black jacket is, doesn't she? There's one hanging up in the in the there. There's one hanging up in my room. There's jackets everywhere, and uh, you know, keep watching. There's secret jackets all throughout this video. If, if there's an issue, I'm I can just head on out and get back to work because I'm I'm flat chat. I genuinely forgot. I I broke. Uh, I made this. I told you. If it's an front. issue, I'll just jump on out. Honestly, Fine. jump on out. Oh snap! <laughs> Just jump on out, Jesus! Far out, she's ruthless, isn't she? If that's what you'd like to do, come on. Wearing a jacket is not. I asked you two and a half hours ago. It's not the hardest request. Amber, please. This is not the only thing there's I'm doing one, today. Yeah, there's one hanging on the rack. I know there's two. I look. I look. Once again, back at it with the where the jackets are. She knows. She knows exactly where they are. I know it's not your issue, but I did ask Thank Julie you. two and a half hours Can ago. I you no, no, that's fine. If it's black. black. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Out of nowhere. She's a bomb. This good? Got it? Who's even is that? Whose bloody jacket is that? As long as that mic's working for everyone. Go for there. Time now to head into the chat room and joining me today is psychologist Sandy Ray in Melbourne and Nine's Julie Snook in Sydney. A big welcome to both of you. Thank you for joining Hello. us. Good afternoon. Pleasure. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, you just fucking calm as like, yeah, it didn't even happen. No one look look, it's go time. When the chat room nine nine news chat room's going, it's going. The show must go on. If she didn't get that black jacket, we would have seen murder on the news. First up today, there are explosive allegations that Russia has extremely damaging information on Donald Trump, allegedly involving Trump participating in a very lewd sexual act. Now, it's all pretty explicit and nasty. Trump has taken to Twitter to... <laughs> Make news, total political witch hunt. Oh, he's good, isn't he? Deny the claims. Sandy, if it's investigated and found to be true, I mean, should he be impeached or is the soon to be most powerful man in the world going to get away with this? Just like seemingly everything else. Nothing better than an Australian newscaster, first of all, that has just skits it about a white dress, three people wearing a white, the same colour, 
than suggesting that he should be that the president of America, a whole different country, should be impeached for p- allegations. Jesus Christ, if he's found guilty. Look at that. God. Well, it seems like Donald Teflon Trump seems to be his name, doesn't it? No matter what he's... <laughs> No matter what he does, he seems to be able to get out of it. But I think, you know, whether or not these are proven or disproven, I think what we really need to recognise is that this office, indeed any Prime Minister, President, needs to be of the highest ethical and moral standards. Why? Because you said so. That's ridiculous. You've got no idea what... You don't need ethics and morals to be President, right? Not these days. You need a Twitter, an active Twitter account with good governance and good jurisprudence and really our personal values have to be absolutely a hundred percent and whether or not this is proven to be true or or, you know not true I think Donald Trump really needs to be very mindful of all his actions and reactions yeah Julie what do you think I'll tell you what I think I think you should shut the fuck up I'm taking this jacket off and I'm gonna strangle you with it oh she is fuming Well, let's remember, this man is days away from being elected as the leader of the free world, the leader. We've heard from um, outgoing President Barack Obama today, who has been in that role for eight years, scandal-free. Donald Trump, President-elect Trump, has more scandals surrounding him in the lead-up to this inauguration than, than Barack Obama did in his entire time as president. I just, what is concerning to me and what is almost sad is that we've come to accept this type of behaviour from Donald Trump. We've learned to accept this now. You just look at it, you just bent, you just bent over backwards for a black jacket because one witch told you, oi, we can't have three people wearing white, we need some diversity on here. And he has been voted in as the leader by the American people. So I, I do, I think it's one of these things, he, he's going to get away with it. I, I don't know how. But I, I just feel like he will, yet again, get away with it if, if it is proven to be true. Yeah, it's going to be a very, very interesting four years here. In conclusion, guys, your show means absolutely fuck all. No one gives a shit about three people wearing a white dress or not. No one cares at all. You're the only one that does. Look, even even the chick you were blasting was like, I'll oh, get out of here, I don't care, I've got other things to do. Just because chat room's your main priority, Amber, doesn't mean it's everybody else's.